morning and welcome to TransWest Truck Trailer RV of Frederick. It is a beautiful snowy day here in Colorado. Uh, my name is Callie Say and I'm in, at TransWest in Trailer Sales. So if you're looking for a brand new trailer, we carry some runs and Logans. If you're looking for something used, we take anything from little bumper bowls to big LQs in on trade. We're about 30 minutes north of Denver. Um, and what I've got to show you right here today is actually a little used one that we took in. This is one that we sold originally, so it's kind of cool to get them back in on trade. We run every single used trailer that comes in through our shop. If it's a living quarter, it goes through both our house and our chassis shops. Um, but obviously just the runarounds will go through the, the chassis side. That means that when we get them in, they check bearings, repack bearings, uh, check brakes. They put them on the alignment machines. They run through and make a big list of anything that, that could be an issue on this trailer and then we go in and fix a lot of things some of the cosmetic stuff we don't touch it is a used trailer and there's a reason that they're at a discounted price but anything that's safety related um, automatically gets fixed and then um, a lot of the little stuff just to make it a little bit nicer for the next owner we will go ahead and fix so this one right here behind me is one that came in it is a 2019 logan xtr two horse bumper pull warm blood. Now these warm blood models do not stick around very long. Um, this one is in really great shape. It's got a lot of the really cool upgrades that Logan did on their warm bloods. And everything on this trailer is completely standard. So we ordered this one just exactly standard and you can see all the cool upgrades on it. This little pink tag when you're walking around our lot signifies that this trailer has been through our shop. So that means even this little bumper pull, it got put on the alignment machine. This one actually had tires that were out of date. So it got new tires when it came in, which I will show you when we circle around. And then it actually took a, tra a trip to the wash. So it got a wash cleaned inside and outside. So it's really nice and ready for the next owner. Some of the cosmetic things that we don't touch, um, I'll point out here. There's a little bit of a bump right here that you can see. It's kind of hard to see in photos, but it's nice about the videos is we can kind of point them out so that a customer, if they were to ship this trailer directly from our lot to their home, you know, they have an idea of, of everything that's on it. We have a ghosted sticker up there and a little bit of a ding right here, but not much. Like I said, this trailer's pretty darn clean. It came in in really good shape. Now for the tack room, Logan does a nice big tack room on their warm blood models. This is seven, six tall, six, nine wide. So we've got running board running from the front to the back. We've got a four tier swing out blanket bar on the door here, a little brush box down below. And then once we step up in here, this model in particular came standard with an insulated roof from front to back. So that means the tack room has an insulated roof and the uh, stall area has an insulated roof. We've got tons of bridle hooks along the top and bottom here. And then you've got a four tier saddle rack We've got two here, um, but you've got optional placements for two additional, or you can move these up and down if you've got something you want to put underneath it and need a little more clearance. Came standard with a little boot box here, so you can move that out, uh, swing it around, set it down wherever you want in here. Just gives you plenty of room. And then our spare tire over here in the corner. And then up above, we've got this nice big clothes rod, some additional hangers. And then it came with this nice big square water tank here with hose. So as a standard optioned trailer on this two horse bumper bowl, it is really well optioned. You've got tons of storage space um, to use if you're heading to shows. Since this is a warm blood straight load, we've got escape doors with drop down windows on either side of the trailer so you can walk your horses in, um, go through the chest bar and then out the side door if you need. Another really cool thing about that is you can swing the store open, throw a bunch of feed in that feed bag that we've got or you can drop this down and get a lot more airflow going. Extrusions down the side sheets here help stiffen up the side sheets as well as this is a lot more heavy duty than these 050 white sheets here. So if you've got a horse that likes to mess around with the sides of your trailer, it's going to hold up a lot better to that. I mentioned earlier that we put new tires on this one. 
The cool thing about tires is you can tell when they were put on based on their date codes. So these are Load Range E tires, which is a 10 ply. And then right here, whenever we ask for people's DOT codes, we're looking for these four digits that are lightly outlined here. This was produced in the 50th week of 2023. So all new matching tires on this one, which is a really nice option if somebody's gonna go and take this trailer and start using it. Got big bus windows over the hip side, as well as eight inch awning lights. Uh, so that if you're tagging up, you can kind of see everything that's going on here. I like to point this out. I think it's great what Logan does with some of their floor systems. This is their whizproof flooring with their sure grip rubber flooring. Now, a lot of people love a draining floor, and I'd say that's probably one of Logan's best features is the ability to have this draining floor. They do what's called vortex lining on their aluminum planks, and you'll see that there's little gaps in between where that urine can run out of the trailer and onto the ground there. So a lot of people do not roll with uh, shavings on these trailers. That urine will, will leave that trailer so quickly. You can still run with them if you want, help soak up um, some of the urine as they, as they pee, but it just is a really great option, makes it so easy to clean out. It also allows for some additional airflow to come through the floor, keep those little horses a little bit cooler. Um, your solids will be a lot drier by the time you get there and easier to muck out. Um, so it's just, it's just a really cool system. It's completely permanent floor system, so you don't have to worry about pulling mats. Uh, you can just power wash it out. A lot of people, if they do ever want to put shavings in there, we do recommend the larger size flake. And that's just so that it doesn't get stuck in those holes as it goes down. But they've done some cool tests on these floors and the horses are a lot more stable when they ride on this sure grip style floor here. And that's because they don't have those mats shifting up underneath them as you drive. Helps reduce some, reduce some vibration as well. Now at the rear here, we've got a rear ramp with wraparound Dutch doors. Now we've just got holdbacks on these Dutch doors. So they're not really meant to be run open, um, but they've got nice big bus windows on them as well. So you can open up those bus windows and get some nice airflow moving. This rubber mat here has some good grip and traction on it. It's nice and coated with that, um, that rubber tread. You can kind of see there, gives it, gives it a non-slip surface. And then in the actual stall area here, we've got 90 inches from the butt bar to the chest bar and 37 inches from the chest bar to the very front of that wall there. So nice big stalls for those warm blood horses. These Logans are a galvanized steel frame with aluminum sheeting. So that galvanized steel is not like black steel. We don't have the rust issues with it. They actually offer a lifetime warranty for the first owner against any structural corrosion because you're you're um, galvanized steel, you're not black steel. So you're not gonna really need that warranty, but it helps people kind of keep their peace of mind. And then they, sh they lighten these trailers up with that aluminum sheeting. And it makes for a really, really strong frame, um, but still easy enough to pull around. So one of the things you'll see a lot of is this vortex lining. Anywhere they've got that galvanized steel, they're gonna coat it in this vortex lining. And it also makes a really good, good kick wall material. We've got padding on either side of the divider, as well as the wall here. Keep those horses nice and comfortable and off the walls. And then the stall area on this one is lined and insulated. We've got padding here at the rear. So if your horses are backing out and throw their heads up, you know, they're gonna hit this padding as opposed to that, that bar there. And then this divider actually swings from side to side. So if you've got a horse that is a little bit difficult to load, you can always kick this over to the side here, give that horse some more space so they don't feel so claustrophobic, and then push it over back into place. We've got roof vents at the very front here, as well as these huge feed bags. You have the ability to pop these chest bars out and walk out and, and through if you need to. And then you've got tie rings on either side there that you can throw up. Now, the cool thing about these dividers is they're completely removable. So if you ever needed to run this as a box stall, um, the, they can push up against the ceiling. This 
part here collapses and you can take this whole divider out. Now it's probably a two person job, but it is a cool option that if you have to haul, you know, a lawnmower, a Marin foal, anything like that, it just gives you so much more flexibility with how you use your trailer. Nice LED lights on these ones. Keeps it nice and bright in there. And then as we work our way over to this side, this trailer is running on two 3,500 pound rubber torsion axles. So you've got plenty of axle underneath this trailer. We've got the eight inch awning light on this side as well. So you can tack up over here, not have any issues. These drop down windows have these nice little screens on them. So if you're running with those drops down, um, your horses are going to be nice and protected. You don't really have to worry about running with the fly masks. It just kind of gives you an extra layer of protection, but still allows a lot of airflow through. And as we work our way back to the front, we've got diamond plating down low here, which is going to help protect this trailer from a lot of the road blasts that we see. And then you'll see more of that vortex lining down low. So even though this one's a 2019, it still looks really clean. It's been completely run through our shop. This trailer is ready to roll. And if you've got big horses, you know, this is a really good option to go with. So for anybody interested in this one, um, you can check out it, check it out on our website. The stock number is 5U240243. It is a 2019 Logan Coach Warmblood two horse bumper pull. If you guys have any particular questions on this one or any others that we have on the lot, you're always welcome to give me a call. My name is Callie Say. My phone number is 970-309-6368. You can call or text at that number. We've got original build sheets on these ones we can send over to you if you want to see dimensions a little bit closer. But I really appreciate you guys taking the time to tune in with us today. I hope everybody stays warm and dry and uh, have a great Friday.